Hello everybody and welcome back to the Tales of Magiel. And I'm, I'm actually really excited to uh, continue playing this game here and seeing what comes next. Uh, let's see, so we are continuing the Adventures of Caesar. And I think in the last episode we kind of uh, got a little lucky here. We went through, um, whose tower was it? I don't know, but the guy was a magic user, and, you know, I don't really like those magic users very much. Um, I think I may have to, uh, work on my inventory a little bit, though. Because, as brought to my attention, some of my stats are a little lacking. And also, I'm trying to figure out, what do I do with this stuff here? I mean, do I, what do I do? I tag this thing? Or... Plot item, I don't See, I don't know. I'm not really sure at the moment about that. But I guess... I guess I can at least equip a belt. God knows I need a belt. Where'd that... I guess that was what I equipped. Oh, let's see. Can we use to fire a blast of psionic energies in a beam? Well... Wow, 66 to 133 damage? That's that's actually pretty sweet. Alright, this is a belt, right? What's this? This is a charm torque. Let's, uh, let's equip this sweet, mighty girdle. Where'd this go? Oh, okay. Wait, what is this? Oh, it's a, it's a ring, I think, right? I feel stupid, but... That's okay. And a cape. I don't have a sweet cape to use, unfortunately. But I think I can sell some things, though. Um, trying to reduce the likelihood of getting, well, the sink for that matter, because that's always a ever apparent danger when recording something like this. And also. What am I trying to say here? I want to try and cash in on some of the items I do have here. Uh, regeneration infusion. For some reason, I like that. It just sounds really helpful or hopeful. I don't see myself using this because I'm not really knowledgeable in its use. I'm probably going to be an idiot for selling them, but. You know, this is my first real run at this game, so I'm going to make a lot of stupid uh, mistakes, I'm sure of it. Brass Lantern of Focus, I think I might keep that just because. Yeah, I think just because. And Zircone, let's uh, sell that. 24 gold, it's more than I've ever had in my life. I do not have enough gold. How much gold do I have? 68? Oy. Rough times for me, I'd, I'd say. Okay, so a slime-covered longsword. I don't want a long, slime-covered longsword, you know? It's just too slimy. Battle axe, I don't like two-handed weapons. I'd, I probably should, but I don't. And so I'm going to sell it. And I just sold it. And what is this now? This is a... That's not a pair of boots, that's... Just let me look at this, come on. Alright, so... Sharp, long, and deadly, like me. And, um... Let's see, Falikath, Smolder Edge. And that's a long sword, isn't it? Yeah. I think that should be enough, or at least I should be able to get away with it. Uh, I don't think that's... Is this massive? 28. Okay. I can't really equip that, unfortunately. Crystals, astral bindings. I thought I equipped this, but I guess not. Minor roots, a uh, pair of rough leather boots. Oh god, it's like. Trying to figure. Oh my god, well, wow. yeah, that weighs a lot of. That weighs a lot. You know, I'm going to go on the assumption I might find something better. It's a bad philosophy to go by, but... You know, it happens. Especially to me. 
Reinforced iron shield. I would think this one might be better. What is it? 4, 6 armor. 9 damage. No. Nope. That's being sold. That's just my very basic assessment of it. And this is worth quite a bit. Holy moly guacamole. Powered by arcane forces and crafted by a master. This is going to be kind of a slow start to this episode, but this this kind of stuff happens. You've lived through it, and um, you know, you're definitely no stranger to it. So if anything, it feels like home for you. How about that, all right? So yeah. And magic and stuff, I mean, I'd like to keep it because it just seems like, you know, back in Diablo 2, when you see something that's a different color like this, you wanna keep it because it usually means it's a good thing. But I want the money. I want the money. What do I want to do here? Yeah, I... Let me compare quickly. Just so I'll feel a little bit better about my situation, I guess. Zero, one defense, or one armor. Armor plus one, damage. Melee, changes resistance, fire. And this is... That just seems like... It seems to do what I have already, except the plus armor portion of it. Is there a spell resistance? Resistances, the darkness and temporal. I guess maybe that might, you know, just because it seems like a three piece of armor to begin with here, I think it justifies me at least giving it a shot. Now let's use my hard earned money to probably not buy anything after all that work. And of course, I'm probably going to be very disappointed here. Well. Aesthetic Steel Greatsword, uh, that's going to be a two-handed weapon, though. So I can't do that. And none of this really lives up to what I'm looking for here. Am I right? Am I right? And, um, wait, 22 power? Man, look at this. Such an exciting episode for me buying stuff. And I can't afford it, uh, son of a monkeys. Alright, so let's um, let's get out of here and actually do something for today. I'm afraid to go back into that one level I went to because, well, as you know, I opened a tomb and uh, something bad came out of it. A level 22 um, really bad creature, so I'm not going back there for the time being. Not until I'm a little bit power more powerful. We get into the maze. Now that kind of scares me a little bit, but there's so much to explore here. Mysterious hole in the beach. Now that just doesn't sound good to begin with. And that is a, a Grimly the Hermit. Um, what's up buddy? Wanna talk? After a great deal of pounding, a halfling wrapped in charred, smoking robes opened the doors. He looks irritated. Not enough that I work all morning to make a potion that ends up nearly blowing my ass off. Oh god, I got idiots beating down my damned front door with what sounds like a battering ram. And yes, I heard it. Though I can hardly make out a bleeding thing with these bleeding cast ears. What could do you want? I, uh, let's see, I guess we can do a quest here. Speak up, Hambrain. Got my eardrums blown off by yet another by the pyre of ocean down itself. Remember, Trice damn thing was going perfectly too. Talk nor his tackle. Said maybe there's something I can help you with. Oh my god, how can I help? It's not a very hermit like attitude. I would say that. Well, fans of field alchemy, but da da. Horde, da da. Don't ask here. <laughs> Run to steal every secret they got, write them down, make 100 copies, and nail one to a tree in every village. I like your attitude. 
then what will they do once their precious secrets, which in all probability either don't exist or anything like recipes for elixirs, da 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 da, -da gives a flying duck, are out, oh wow, you're speaking of a pretty big game here. I'm in, let's do this, Brotherhood of Alchemists. Uh, let's see, press J to see the quest log, thank god I saw that. Okay, so let's see, um, the elixir of explosive force. Here's a list of the stuff I need. Most of it will try to kill you, so I hope you're not incompetent. I've got plenty of incompetent help already. Oh, well, um, I can always assume I'm pretty good at this stuff, so. Uh, let's see, so. Wait a second. We found all the clues leading to a hidden treasure. There should be a way on the third level of the Trollmire. Wait a second. Hidden treasure? Oh, okay, buddy. Chill. Okay, I just want to click on this map here. Thank you. Trollmire, there's treasure there? Alright, let's uh, revisit this place. Maybe uh, it's worth uh, checking out again. Wasn't this... What the? Well, at least I can... Uh... Oh, Cold Drake... Didn't these guys almost kill me the last time? So I'm kind of a little scared with these guys. I mean, they did a lot of damage to me the last time I saw them, so... But I guess... Yeah, I guess I'm fine. I love that Vitality um, move, though. It's so helpful. It's so helpful. That's a flower. Okay. Now, did I even explore much of this place? Because we did defeat the boss in this area, right? So I'm kind of confused. Let's go here. Because I'm assuming these people are pretty nice in that. They're not going to just... Oh, fine, you want to die? Fine, there you go, you're dead. And there's more guys here. Okay, so they respawn somehow. Okay. And um, I'm just taking it a little easy in terms of uh, the tapping of the keyboard. Just trust me, sometimes desync can be a really horrible enemy of yours if you're not careful. Because, yeah, as you can tell, you can probably hear a little bit of the key tapping every now and then, so, I mean, it happens, especially with me, but I'm, I'm pretty certain I beat this area, so what is up with this? A lot of trolls, a lot of trolls here, wow. I was not expecting this amount of resistance, thank you. And this is a cave troll, wow. Yeah, if anything, I will get some experience from all this, so I'm definitely happy with this. Okay, what's going on here? I thought I beat this place. But on the bright side, it says it's an easy area, so, you know, whatever treasures. Yeah, open it. What, forest troll? You know what I'm going to do to him? One, two... Well, three-ish, and you're dead. Build a stone troll. Okay, so there's a lot more to this than I was expecting. Wow. You want to die, build a stone troll? Taking care of your kind before. I'm going to do it again. And let's use some, uh... Infusion, Regeneration, and Wrath of the Woods, and you're going to be dead. I thought I did this already, though. Items in the chest will not encumber you. This chest is an extension of old sure tool. Okay, so was this the quest that I was well, looking for? I don't care, I'm grabbing every 
Option unlocked, new birth equipment. Transmogrification chest. You have discovered an old fortress belonging to the mysterious Shirtul race. Fortress Shadow gave you a chest shall make your dealing with storage and gold much easier. All your new characters will now start with trans sweet. And Girdle of the Calm Water is cool. Alright, I can take on anything else at this point, even though it's wow, there's a lot of things. That was really unexpected, I would say. I can take on you guys. I'm not scared. I'm not scared. There's a lot of you guys here, but I'm not scared. I'll take your money, though, so thank you. Why does this seem like one of those places where there would be, like, really bad enemies around here? There's a lot of money, though. I'm taking it. Oh, so was that perhaps what, um, that rock was about? Pretty much you open it, then you're going to be in a lot of trouble. Because I heard there are places like that in these stages. Like you open a door or something like that. What is this? What? Wait, what did I drop? Did I drop anything? No. Okay. I didn't read too much into that, though. So, it's not going to bother me much. But did that take care of whatever... Yeah, we did. Yeah, I took that treasure from him, man. He's dead. I didn't even know I was going to kill that guy. I thought this place was already cleared out. And apparently I got to the... Wow. I didn't realize I was in the second level already. I didn't think I got to the third... Oh. Okay, what is up with this? Ah, you stupid things. Do you mind? There's a lot of resistance here. Nothing I can't handle. But I think in the meantime, what am I going to do? I'm going to use this rod of recall and just get out of here that way. Because, you know, I spent a little too much time here. There we go. Alright, so that's not too bad. Uh, so the last place, Ruins of Corpool, we uh, kind of messed him up pretty badly. He didn't even stand a chance. And I gained a level, too. So as we enter this new mysterious land, um, let's go ahead and level up. So what is this exactly here? Okay, so cunning defines your character ability to learn, think, and react. How about, how about resist mental attacks? It increases your spell power and the effect of spells. So I guess this is kind of my resistance. I would like two on that, and maybe one to that. Why not? And I do love these abilities so much. Fast metabolism. Combat focus, regenerate life faster. I love it. And what is this? Spell shield. Vigorous training allows you to be more resistant to some spell effects. Oh, really? Oh, I thought I had at least two. Unflinching resolve, you learn the ability quickly. Da -da 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 -da. Cunning. How about this? Unshackled. I'm not even sure what mental save means exactly. And was this cunning? Uh, no, willpower. I do love Wrath of the Woods, so I'm not going to mess with that. 
That is a, this is a little wordy. What's up, buddy? A halfling gardener. Looks like looks like Frodo. And what is this? An herbalist. Nope. Wait, that's my stuff. Never mind. Wielded or worn. I'm sure there's a way you can actually, um... Yeah, do that. I know there's gotta be a way to, um, actually imbue this stuff, but... God knows I don't know about that one. Smolder Edge. Wait. Phase door ruin? Regeneration. No, 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 no. no. I had a little too much fun here. Let's uh, just. Second thought, let's just go into another dungeon. How about that? Hopefully, one that doesn't have a bunch of, like, magic users. It's the last thing I need right now. So, let's see. Let's go eastward here. What is this? Allied. Okay, a bunch of halflings. Okay, what? Hostile. Take care of them, man. I didn't know there were a bunch of hostiles. They can duke it out themselves, though. So they're friendly, they're friendly. They're friendly. I thought they were going to kill me, like, big time. Passageway into the... Daikara. Okay, is this going to be a very tough level, or... Wow. This feels claustrophobic here. It's a giant? A giant? You wanna die anytime soon, buddy? I'm gonna ruin you. You know that, right? Wow. Okay, so we got a bunch of giants here. That is just fantastic. Level 10. Cultist. Oh boy. And he has a... Uh, okay, so he has magic on his side. I am getting out of here. Well, I'm still alive. Just in case things go south here, um, I definitely do not want to be... What was it? Drake? Okay, so let's, uh... Let's do what I do best here. Uh, Wrath of the Woods. Okay, let's uh, just leave here. How about that? I have no idea how to kill those guys. Wow. You guys gotta be kidding me. I do not know what that's about, but my god. They just messed me up something fierce. Half dead lumberjack, before you stand. Before you stand, a man covered in dirt and blood, he is out of breath and half mad. Please, you must help it. Slaughtering everybody in my village, please. If I go, I will go there and see what I can do. Ah, oh, mamma mia. Okay, well, let's, let's see here. Um, I'm feeling brave. Kind of. Let's save this village, how about that? You're screaming not too far from me. Oh boy. So, okay, so a lumberjack, and you guys are just running. Great. Wait, where is that coming from? Hello? Anybody? Oh, oh, oh. Uh oh. 
Oh, mamma mia. So, oh, this is it? You're going down, buddy. Hey. Dude, you can't just do that. You gotta fight me like a man, and then die. Oh, someone's gonna get killed. It's gonna be a... Ben Kruthdar, the Cursed. Ben lies defeated at your feet. Thank you for <coughs> saving me from the curse. I did not want to do this. To he coughs one last time and dies. Smile on his face as he his curse is gone. Wow, I am a great person. Wow. A curse lifter, roguelike. Killed Ben Kruthdar, the Cursed. That's cool. I feel happy about that. And most saved the... You saved most of us. Please make sure, or take this as a reward. Give you a miner's iron pickaxe, which is uh nice. Remaining lumberjacks, collect some gold and thank you. 18 gold. I want more than that. I don't do this stuff for free. Oh god, what is this? I can't see these things. Watch, there's gonna be like a level infinity creature here that's gonna kill me. Isn't there? Anyways, I will be right back. Okay, and hopefully, hopefully, uh, what I did was just stop the recording quickly, restart it. So hopefully, nothing really desyncs here, or to reduce the chance of it desyncing. So right now, oh, thank you goodness. There's gonna be something horrible in one of these rooms. Watch. I got an idea. Oh, wait, let's see. Okay, let's uh, let's be a little smart here about this. We are going to use the Rod of Recall. And on the last turn, we are going to open this room up and hopefully it's not a huge evil beast that's gonna kill me. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. All items in the chest will be transmogrified. Mogrified. Go for it. Yeah, do it, do it. Uh, Pretty sweet. It's probably not the best thing I could do, but I take advantage of it nonetheless. And what is this? Last hope. Is this just a village? Maybe? Probably just a village, right? And this is a human citizen. Alright, so just a bunch of humans here. Nothing all that wild here. I guess I can check uh, inventory and see if there's anything new for me here. So, so far, girdle of stuff. Low power, let's see, rose. Da, 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 da. How much gold do I have? How much gold do I have? Let me see here. Oh, it's okay. It creates gold for me. I see. So anything I did have, it turned into gold. It makes sense because it told me that. Shows how much I'm really uh, focusing here. Ooh, look at this old Tower of Dreadfell and lava. Something tells me I don't want to go there. Maybe here too, that seems really elusive for now. I just don't want to bite off more than I can chew here. Just want to kind of keep it basic for the most part. Hello. Hitting compound. 
since it's going to have like a lot of uh, giants and magic users that know how to do a lot of things that I can't. Oh, that's sad. It's a enthralled slave. Level 12. Know what I have to say to that? Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> Feel like your time is better spent somewhere else. Yep. My thoughts exactly. Counter. Uh, I don't know. I don't like what I hear from this. Trapped. Drats. Alright, so I have to be the hero again. Oh god. Please let this not be like a uh, my death. It's gonna be a trap, I know it is. That's how these things always go. Help me, help me. Uh, what is this? Kurt Cup Purse? I don't think so, buddy. You're dead. What? A rogue? Get out of here. You're a rogue. You're not, you got nothing on me. I'm a bulwark. That's even the correct pronunciation of it. I'm sorry, you don't use certain words enough times. You just don't get it. Uh, let's open the chest, why not? A bandit? Bandit Tito? Bandito? Ow. I got this. Your treasure is mine. Yes it is, buddy. Now let's see, what, what did I pick up? I'll never know actually. So, oops. But, that was pretty cool. I'm always very nervous when it comes to chests. And I, I saw you, buddy. I saw you. Come here. Okay, well, let's, uh... Yes, new achievement. I got someone to level 10. I feel like a winner. Alright, can I get a little bit of time to, uh, you know, get a little bit of a break here? Wait, what is this? Fine, you don't want to, like... What was that? Yeah, I really don't get what just happened there, but... It is what it is, I suppose. And... Okay, so let's see here. What did I want to do before? Um... Oh, I like that. It allows counter-strikes after incomplete blocks. Nice, I like that. I like that a lot. And, let's see, spell shield, that's right, that's what I wanted to do before. And let's uh, max son of a gun. Category points. Um, learn a new talent. Dirty fighting, I like that. Oh, I thought it. Okay, whatever. I'll I'll go with what I have right now, it's based on ignorance. This is going to be. The last dungeon, I would say, for this episode. Saw a lot of things I wish I didn't see, but... You know, sometimes it is what it is, and you can't do much about it. Ah, there we go. So there's that floor. 
Wait a second. Yeah, move, get that out of here, please. Yeah, move to normal inventory. And move to inventory. I might need that. I'm pretty sure I m will need that. I see iron mail. 2-4 armor. Wait, why am I caring about that? Gauntlets. Oh, elementals battle axe, wow. Oh boy, yeah. Okay, so a glowing chest. Uh, let's open it and... Yeah, of course. guys fight dirty, I'll tell you that much. Wow. Right. Unerring, un unerring scalpel, scalpel, scalpel. Jeez, they kicked my butt. And I'm not opening any of these doors, thank you. Human. You want to be like friends or something or what? Where were these guys? Lost merchant. They're neutral. What are you? Neutral also? Oh, he didn't want to talk. Please save me. I will make it worth your. Oh, sh Shut up! Before you stands a menacing man and cloth and black, oh, the intruder at last, and what shall we do with you? Why did you kill my men? Heard some cries in your men, they were on my way. What's going on here? Oh, so this is the part where I tell you my plan before you attack me. Get this intruder! You know what? Yeah, you might be a. Uh, well, I need somebody to replace the man you killed. You look sturdy, maybe you could work for me. You'll have to do some dirty work for me, though. You'll be bound to me. Nevertheless, you may make a quite a profit from this venture if you're as good as you seem. Do not think of crossing me, that would be unwise. Just let me and the merchant get out of here and you may live. Oh, what, what level is this guy? I forgot. He's gonna have a lot of stuff. Bad stuff, I'm sure. A lot of tricks up his sleeve. So you want to kill me? So let me and the merchant get out of here and you may live. He's level 12, so who cares? Rats. Alright, well, Wrath of the Woods it up. And, uh, that. God. And this is the part where I die, isn't it? And I have died. Oh, crud. Oh, that was such a bummer. I should have just went with that guy. Uh, let's see, during your game you have... During your game you unlocked birth option. Unlocked the class Cursed. Gained new achievement, Curse Lifter, and went to level 10. That's such a bummer. Rats. I didn't think you'd get all the people possible on my... <sighs> well, we gotta keep with the uh, same old, same old guy here. K 
can't give up on Caesar. Right? So I guess in the next episode, uh, since we died, we're gonna have to pick up the pieces and just uh, take on Norgo's lair or something like that. Who knows? Anyways, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.